everybody wants to have a house. Everybody wants to have a, his own house. Five years ago, Christy Lynn Verasami and her family were left homeless after flash floods devastated their home. The situation in which we, we were at that moment was very, very, very difficult. We didn't have any house, uh, any clothes, any food, and everything. In many developing countries, there is little hope for poor families whose circumstances take a turn for the worse. But in its drive to eradicate poverty, Mauritius is looking to social mechanisms to protect the vulnerable. Speaking at the Africa-China Poverty Reduction and Development Conference, Prime Minister Pravin Jugnauth emphasized the government's commitment to housing. Government is also implementing a social housing policy as we believe that homelessness, overcrowding, insecure housing can be an insurmountable obstacle for families making efforts to escape poverty. Less than 1% of the country's 1.2 million people live in extreme poverty. The government's social register connects them to services and benefits like housing. These people, they are found under the SRM, the Social Register of Mauritius, which means they have a revenue that, are le that is less than $300 per month for a, for a typical family of two adults and three kids. The government housing project not only gives people safe places to live, but also gives them the pride of owning their own homes. The house, we were not in security. There was no security. If, if uh, there is a cyclone, everything was vanished, then you built again. Uh, you, we had problems to have water, to have electricity. So when uh, the government gave us the key of this house, it was a dream which was coming true. Mauritius is among Africa's top-ranked countries when it comes to economic stability, good governance and development, making it popular with tourists and investors. And when it comes to poverty alleviation, Preserving the gains of the past means investing in future generations. The, the, what we are targeting here is also the children. Before they were living in corrugated iron sheet, rusted, you know, and the plastics. Now they are in this house, they got a better living, and they are being able to go to school. Poverty should never be a heritage to be passed on to future generations. Through this government housing project, Residents will ultimately own these homes and the land they're built on, which means for many families, the cycle of poverty ends here. Lindim Tongana, CGTN, Port Louis, Mauritius.